As a Paralympian, it's very important to have a reliable support team around you. And for me, distance education was a huge part of that. Um, in the couple of years leading up to London, my daily routine involved either gym or swim in the morning, schoolwork in the middle of the day, and then track session in the afternoon. I'd love to qualify for Rio, that would be an ultimate goal. If someone wanted to follow my pathway, I would suggest to them to not underestimate how difficult and how much hard work is involved in competing at elite level and most importantly, just have fun along the way and enjoy what you're doing. He's a really great kid. He works really hard in the water. He trains really well. It's, it's what you need to do to be a successful swimmer. You've got to put in the hard work, and if you do put in the hard work, you're going to get great results. You know, the results he's had, you know, throughout his career have been fantastic. He, he made the Paralympics last year. And that's going to drive him to go forward and, and to hopefully make the next Olympics in 2016. By doing my schoolwork through Sydney Distance Education High School, it has allowed me to compete in the 2012 London Paralympic Games in 2012 and train very hard for it. One day you could represent Australia.